Well, hello on this Tuesday. Lee Harder from the TND with you today. News of our COVID tight. We have a mother from Orangeburg who's in a, engaging in a legal battle, joined in a legal battle that uh, opposes the idea that schools cannot implement uh, mask mandates. Also, the fact that more access to online learning. Uh, that is, it's a continuing debate in South Carolina, and we're going to have to see where all the legal cases surrounding those issues go. Also, today, news of a couple of disturbing shooting incidents, one in a shopping center parking lot in which a man was injured by gunshots, another one in which uh, gunshots were fired into a vehicle, that, in which there was also a one-year-old. Thankfully, no one there was hit. Uh, Pfizer vaccine, back to the coronavirus, gets full okay. You can read a lot of national news about that and what's going on with other vaccines. Three COVID, further, further COVID deaths reported um, in our region. Also, um, big news really for a lot of people looking for work and employers looking for employees. The SC Job Works is going to have a very large job fair. Um, 70 employers featured uh, at the Orangeburg City Gym on Broughton Street from 11 to three on Wednesday. Uh, a lot of COVID protocols in place there, but you still should be able to get in, get, a, get access and, and have a chance to look at um, positions with any number. And most of these people, by the way, are Orangeburg area employers. So this is, this is a real opportunity. All right, over in sports, we, we previewed region 6A, which is called the, by one of the coaches, the SEC of class A football. Uh, a lot of tough teams in there. All right. Uh, Hope you have a good day. Check us out at the TND.com. We're still running uh, specials there. You can get full access to our website for a real bargain. Um, and just give it a shot. Uh, we think you'll stay around if you um, become a subscriber. All right. Have a good day.